After the family of a woman killed by a callous hit and run driver is grieving and pleading with the suspect to turn themselves in immediately. And tonight, Leda Medina's husband is speaking out about his wife, Rachel Menatoff, joining us live from North Hollywood with more on their story. Rachel. Rick Kareen, this is such a tragic situation. Leda and her husband were training for a 5K. She was doing a solo run last night around 7 o'clock. She was in this marked crosswalk here at the intersection of Victory Boulevard and Beck Avenue when a driver fatally hit her and immediately took off. She leaves behind her loving husband, Kevin. They've been together since they were 16 and 17 years old, respectively, and married for one of those years. She was just 27 years old. She was also very close to her younger sister, her parents, and her niece and nephews. According to LAPD, the driver of a Toyota Corolla traveling west on Victory hit her and kept on going. Officers later found the car abandoned along Victory east of Troost. Police say the man ran away. The windshield of his car was completely cracked and the front passenger side damaged from the impact. Authorities described the offender as a man in his 50s with balding hair and a heavy set build. Leda's husband says running in this area had become routine for his wife. It was one of her passions. And as you can imagine, her untimely and violent death comes as a complete shock and he is absolutely devastated. Every time she leaves for a run, she always tells me to call her in an hour if I don't hear from her. An hour has gone and I called her the first time she didn't pick up, which raised an alarm because she always picks up. So I walked out to try to see if she was probably on her way back. Maybe she couldn't hear her phone because she was busy running. Um, the second call was when a staff member at the hospital answered. And that's when I was told that she was brought in critical condition to the hospital. We've never processed something like this before, but we're trying to do it together as a family. Yeah. LAPD detectives are asking anyone who was in this area around 7 o'clock last night to come forward with information or possible surveillance footage. Leda's family says they are incredibly moved by the community's support. They have an online GoFundMe page, which has raised almost $10,000 for Leda's funeral expenses. That's the latest from North Hollywood. I'm Rachel Menatoff. Rick Kareen, back to you in the studio. Okay, Rachel, thank you so much.